continue with the keyboard shortcut uh, part two. You can do a few convenient little keyboard moves to replace using menus with the mouse button. Now, suppose you've got multiple programs up here and you want to switch back and forth. You take and hold down the Alt key and then you press the Tab key until you get to the one you want to open. There it is. You do it again. Go back to where you want to go. So you can go from program to program to program by simply alt tabbing. Now if you look on the web page uh, there is a whole page that has um, three different charts. You can get the three different charts that have all kinds of keyboard shortcuts for Windows. There's a little bit of Macintosh in there. Um, Word program, everything else. There's a bunch in there. Um, now we get, let's say we open a document we want to go in there and look for a particular word. Um, pretend this is 80,000 pages or something. If you don't see a find key or a find button, there's another way to do it. I think it tells you right here, Control F. So you hit Control F, and then you pick the word that you're going to look for. Let's say the word is...